Hey beauties and welcome to InStyle. So as you already know, I'm going to be doing a lace front wig for you guys. Um, something that I find so important is showing you affordable solutions and also finding companies that offer, you know, very good prices because not everyone can afford to go spend, you know, $500 on a wig, but you still want that good quality hair. So, I found this wonderful website. I'm actually going to show you. And let's see if it focuses in. There we go. It's www.lacewigtrend.com. And if you look right here, I'll probably put the link somewhere in this video so you can go to the site. But this hair is absolutely gorgeous. So, first and foremost, it comes with some instructions on how to care for the hair, how to apply the hair, um, how to apply the lace front wig, um, how to take care of their hair, how to wash the hair. So it's very nice that they give you an instruction manual. And I would like to say that um, one thing that I want to start doing now, especially with my hair, is wearing them for a couple of weeks so I can tell you at least you know, how I feel they're going to last. Um, so this one has been tested for a month. Um, or almost a month. I can tell you this one is Hurricane Irene proof. Like when I tell you I wore this hair in Hurricane Irene and you know you would think it would be a holy hot mess but it made it and it still looks gorgeous. So this is her. This is her curl pattern. Okay. Um, after the hurricane I washed her out. Okay. Um, I didn't really brush it too much. I kind of finger, you know, combed it. And I took the Aussie Catch the Wave mousse, put just a little bit of this in there with, you know, while it was really wet and just let it air dry. And the curl pattern returned like a dream, okay? So first let me tell you about the wig that I'm going to put her on. Honestly, when I applied her during the hurricane, I didn't even use, um any combs whatsoever and she still looked darn good so this one is an indian remy 100 percent deep wave 14 inch in a number four um they said the hairline density is 110 110 percent now i don't know if you can change that you can contact the company um to see if that can change but Okay, um, natural hair along along the pit, so it comes with baby hair, and you'll see the baby hair is gorgeous. It's not too much, not too little. The um, lace that I chose was the light brown, and um, it's a medium cap. So they give you all the information and specifications of your lace front wig, and it comes in this very cute box that has the company name on it. So now I'm just going to show you how I apply this wig. I'm not using any glue. If you want, um, you could glue this wig down, but I want this one to last me forever. So my hair is braided down underneath this, and I'm just going to go around the perimeter and place a little bit of my Wigget Edge Smoother, which really just helps my baby hairs around the edges lay down, and it helps like mix my hair in with the lace okay so this unit has no combs but you do have an area where you can sew them in if you choose and it does come with the two straps in the back. Let me hook them so I don't have to worry about that in a sec. It does come with the two um, hooks in the back. It has about, let's say, a good three and a half, four inches of parting in the front. So let's apply. And I will try my best to style her in the camera, but I might have to turn away to do so. But as you can see already, okay, so wait till you pin her down and you fix her the way you want her to be. 
okay or you glue her down and then let that Also, so you can see the back and to see the density in the back. I actually want to pick out some of the curls because it's a little tightly curled since I washed it. But okay. So I'm also going to show you the amount of part you get in the front. So this is her. Um, I would definitely have to style her or put her the way that I would wear her. But I did... Keep some pictures um, from when I did wear her out as regular. And look at that. Okay, and this is not glued down at all. This is just leaving out the little bit of baby hair. And, you know, so just imagine if you glued this wig down. So I would personally. Oh, another thing I like about this hair is the color. Um, a lot of times when you get Remy hair that's been that comes in like these lighter colors, they are dry, dull, brittle. This one, I don't know if you can tell, is like soft and it's like beautiful, beautiful hair. Okay, um, it's not soft. You can tell it's well hydrated. I would definitely recommend, especially for a wig this nice. Um, for you to, um, you know, make sure you deep condition her and you follow a good hair care regimen. Some products that I would recommend um, for a hair like this, um, because wigs like this, especially if you're going to spend, you know, the money on this one, and you can't beat the price, okay? $120 or less for this wig is unfreaking believable. And it comes straight to your house. Shipping is fast. I mean, like, and this hair is good hair. Um, I really, like, if you guys are looking for a hair any cheaper than this, Human Remy, I don't know if I can find it for you. But at, for it to look this good, okay? So, um, but hair like this you're going to really need to take care of. I can't stress enough, you know, girls buy these expensive wigs and they treat them like crap and then wonder why they don't look good. You have to take care of them just like you do your real hair. You have to moisturize them, you have to wash them, you have to condition and shampoo. And one of the best brands and what I use is the awesome hair care system. Um, for my, you know, weaves, um, for my wigs, I use this because these are purposely formulated to keep the pH balance and, you know, everything, um, you know, correct in the hair. And it really does work. So if you're going to invest in this hair, also invest in good hair care. But um, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you like this wig review. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. And go out and check out this company okay lace wig trend is they've got killer prices okay so as you know like i said I always try to do everything for everyone i like to check out the more expensive hairs i like to check out the cheaper hairs because it at the end everyone you know wants to feel beautiful and wants to find things within their price range so I hope this helps. Um, tell me how you like her. Um, I think she's gorgeous. Bye, guys.